Hey, Jeannie here with Rooted in Love. Today we're going to plant our first seeds in our green stalk. As you know, a few weeks ago we went ahead and filled our green stalk with good organic potting mix and uh, have kept it watered. And remember we did our plan as to when things are supposed to be planted. So here we are and we're going to plant our first seeds and our lettuce is going in today and our spinach, our rainbow carrots, and our dill. So as you begin planting your seeds, you look on the back of each packet. These are from Baker Creek Heirloom Seeds and I love how it tells us on the back of the packet what to do. So if you look, it says when it sprouts, ideal temperature, seed depth, that's very important when you're planting your seeds, that you don't plant them too deep or too shallow. And then seed spacing, that means how far apart the seeds are, and if it's frost hardy and full sun, how many hours a day. But for what we're doing today, the main thing is we need to know the seed depth and the plant spacing. Now I'm going to do in the green stalk a couple of seeds, and then um, it may seem wasteful, but I wanna make sure that the seeds do sprout. And so I'm gonna plant more uh, in here than is going to actually uh, be spaced correctly. Um, and then I'm gonna go back and pull those out once they've sprouted. And if you want to, you can plant them somewhere else or you can just discard them. All right. So as you see, it says the spacing needs to be uh, six to eight inches apart and half an inch seed depth. So as you see, I'm going to come in, I'm going to make this about a half an inch deep. I'm going to put the seeds in and I'm going to cover it back up, pat it down, not too tight, and then I'll water it. So that didn't take very long. So as you see, my green stark is halfway, I just did one side, planted and labeled so I'll know what is supposed to come up so I can keep an eye on that. And then in a few more weeks, I'll plant the later seeds. Here we, here we are at day six since I planted the seeds in the green stalk. So let's see what's going on, if we have any activity. See, let's look at that spinach. I don't see anything. Let's look. Let's look over here. Oh, look. Look at the wee little one. Look at the wee little one in there. Isn't that exciting? Let's see. Oh, we have two coming up there. This is so great. Oh, look at those. Well, keep going, little sprouts. Good morning from East Tennessee. Here we are after yesterday, a warm day. Now we have some snow. Uh, it's only supposed to last a day. And as we saw yesterday, the little sprouts were coming up. But what I did plant already was frost hardy. But I just wanted to make sure that they were going to be okay. We knew this one day of snow and cold was coming. And uh, so I went ahead last night and covered up the, the green stalk. But here we are, our beautiful snow. So you saw that we had that crazy snow. And so tonight it's supposed to get down to 17 degrees here in East Tennessee. And that is not normal. And so since I already have some sprouts in my green stalk, we decided to go ahead and bring in the green stalk into our kitchen for this evening and the next couple of days, just so our little sprouts that are doing so well don't freeze to death. So I wish you the best of luck as you plant your seeds this year, and I hope everything you do is rooted in love.
See you later.